Top 10 Most Expensive Wrist Watches in the World In this list of the top 10 most expensive wrist watches, you will come across a jaw-dropping a collection of sophisticated watches that are fit for royalty and exude charm and elegance with a price to match. These watches not only tell you the time but do a lot more than that. For starters, they signify a status symbol for the person wearing it. Additionally, these watches are also equipped with a multitude of features and functionalities. For a watch enthusiast, these timepieces are simply, timeless. Hallucination by Graf Diamonds $55 million You cannot talk about the world's most expensive watch and not include Graf Diamonds. Hallucination would cost an enormous dent worth $55 million in your pocket. The bracelet of the watch itself is made of platinum, which is then covered entirely in 110 carats of diamonds in myriads of colors. It is a harmonious blend of colors and shapes like blue, yellow, pink and green to go with the heart, emerald, pear, marquees and round shapes. It is the best and the most expensive watch that money can buy. The fascination by Graf Diamonds $40 million. Graf Diamonds is a company that has created the most expensive watch that money can buy and one of them is the fascination, which would set you back by $40 million. Staying true to its name, you will find that this watch containing a 38.13 carat pear-shaped diamond in the center can also be transformed into a ring. The entire watch is studded with a white diamond worth 152.96 carats. The fascination is truly unique and joins our roll call of important jewels, which are among the rarest and most sought-after stones ever uncovered. It is a true celebration of our diamond mastery. The fascination is probably the most expensive three-in-one jewels ever created, with a value of around $40 million. Patek Philippe Grand Master Chime $31 million. A -a one-of-a-kind Patek Philippe Grand Master Chime Ref. 6300A sold for a hammer price of 31 Swiss francs million, about $31 million, at Only Watch, a charity auction held in Geneva to which top watch brands donate special editions. The Grandmaster Chime Reference 6300A010 was created specially for Only Watch, and it is the only one that will ever be made in stainless steel. There are front and back dials, which can be changed via reversible lugs. The salmon-colored front dial bears the inscription, the only one, on the alarm subdial at 12 o'clock. Patek Philippe originally introduced the Grand Master Chime in 2014 in a series of seven pieces to mark its 175th anniversary. It is the most complicated watch Patek Philippe has produced. Jaeger Lecoultre J-O-A-I-L-L-E-R-I-E-101 M-A-N-C-H-E-T-T-E $26 million. The Jaeger Lecoultre Joël Manchette is one of the costliest timepieces ever made. It consists of a substantial band that is polished and encrusted with diamond set links. The small manually winded clockwork sits on the white gold and diamond bracelet. The face of the clock is covered with sapphire glass. The exclusive work of art from Jaeger Lecoultre has 576 diamonds and 11 onyx gemstones. Although no exact information on the complications and design of this masterpiece is available, horologists insist that a similar one was given to Queen Elizabeth II to honor 60 years of her tenure. The 201 carat watch by Chopper $25 million. As the name suggests, this is one of the most expensive wrist watches with about 874 diamonds, which add up to 201 carats. The watch itself is extremely fascinating with several glittering colorful diamonds adorning its surface. Of these, you are likely to spot a blue-colored diamond of 12 carats, a 15-carat diamond in pink and an 11-carat diamond colored white. In addition to this, there are also more diamonds in yellow and white that make up 163 carats of this watch. It's a truly stunning masterpiece. So what exactly makes this piece so special? The watch features an array of colored diamonds in unusual hues and fancy shapes that add to the glamorous appeal, and the value. In fact, the watch is worth a whopping $25 million, making it one of the most expensive timepieces ever after the $55 million hallucination by Graf. Rest assured that the entirely handmade watch is well worth its price tag, however. 
Rich Glare revealed that it contains 874 high-grade diamonds of different colors and sizes. At the center of the gleaming white gold and yellow gold hardware is an internally flawless heart-shaped pink diamond that weighs 15.37 carats, a 12.79 carat heart-shaped blue diamond, and a flawless heart-shaped D-color diamond weighing 11.36 carats. Each of those stones is set in a bracelet that also contains clusters of 260 pear-shaped D-color flawless diamonds and 91 round D-color flawless diamonds weighing 10.29 carats total, which are arranged into flower shapes that feature a round 8.81 carat yellow diamond in the center. Additionally, 26 pear-shaped yellow diamonds that together weigh 17.07 carats are scattered throughout the bracelet. Jacob and CO Billionaire watch $18 million. There is something incredibly graceful about this billionaire watch by Jacob & Co., and its name very aptly describes how you would feel once this watch fits snugly in your wrist. At $18 million, every inch of the wrist watch's body is covered in diamonds worth 260 carats. These diamonds having the classic emerald cut are not the only shiny rocks that make it to the watch. The billionaire also boasts of 19 jewels, about 167 other components and a skeleton face truly making it one of the most luxuriously expensive watch brands. It's officially the world's most expensive timepiece and it was designed by the brand's founder and CEO, Mr. Jacob Arabo in collaboration with Flavio Briatore's billionaire fashion label, hence the name. This amazing watch actually celebrates the friendship between the jeweler and the famed Italian businessman and former F1 boss. Measuring 58 mm by 47.5 mm, this dazzling skeleton timepiece is rather large, featuring an 18K white gold case and bracelet, with 260 carats of emerald cut diamonds covering basically every inch of this watch. Apparently every individual diamond weighs 3 carats, which means this watch will be pretty heavy as well. Apart from the blissful emerald cut baguette diamond stones, you will be surely charmed by the gun blue skeletonized hands which point to the diamond hour markers and on the back of the dial you could also find the billionaire brand logo. Paul Newman Rolex Daytona 17.6 million dollars Paul Newman's Rolex Daytona sold for a whopping $17.8 million in 1968 in front of 400 enthusiasts who gathered at the Philips NY headquarters. It is not a classic design but has a rather Art Deco aesthetic. In place of the regular dial, Paul and his wife opted for the exotic black and white dial. Just like a fabled Hollywood star, who was seen wearing it, it has a whimsical feel. Rolex classifies models like these are, professional, timepieces and the company did not produce too many Daytona models. Paul Newman's Daytona's rarity combined with the customization and personalization easily raked up $17.8 million at the auction. The history of the Rolex Daytona is an interesting one in which this watch developed along parallel lines to the Submariner. Both watches were originally designed for, working men, and served a particular function as timepieces. While the Submariner was specifically built to withstand the pressure of underwater diving, the Daytona, named for the famous racetrack in Florida, was built strictly as a timekeeper of the millisecond variety. Paul Newman's name became inextricably linked to the Daytona when his wife Joanne Woodward gave him the watch when he took up racing in 1972. He is said to have worn the watch constantly until his death in 2008. Incredibly, the watch cost only $210 when it was first produced. Today, it is one of the most sought after of all collectible Rolex models. And miraculously enough, the original Rolex Daytona reference 6239 worn by Paul Newman himself was just reported as found by the Wall Street Journal on June 1, 2017. Patek Philippe Ref. 1518 in stainless steel $11.1 million. Like the Louis Moyne et Mitterrois, the 1518 series by Patek Philippe II is limited edition and only four watches were created. What makes it so special and unique compared to other expensive watches is its unique casing. Usually, Patek Philippe is known for creating watches in yellow or rose gold, but with this version of the 1518, they went for something different and instead made it in stainless steel that exudes panache. 
This watch was created in 1941 and therefore, it invariably was one of the first chronograph watches to have existed by Patek Philippe and it has only recently been auctioned off for $11.1 million. In 1941, Patek Philippe introduced one of the world's most revolutionary and legendary collector's wristwatches, setting the course for their dominance in the world of high-end Swiss watchmaking. Today, the reference 1518 is an icon. With its classic style, elegance and state-of-the-art innovations, owning one is considered a summit for collectors of vintage complicated Patek Philippe wristwatches to achieve, a privilege enjoyed by only a very fortunate few. We are thrilled to have been given the opportunity to offer not just one such rare timepiece, but an unprecedented trilogy of exemplary examples. It is an unprecedented and truly generational event with the inclusion of the mythical, hardly ever seen stainless steel reference 1518. The dial of the yellow gold 1518 has a crisp hard enamel signature on the dial with warm tones throughout. The pink gold version is a must-have for any serious collector, with its superb provenance, formerly belonging to H. H. Windsor, the son of the founder of Popular Mechanics magazine. Fresh to the auction market, the incredible stainless steel 1518 wristwatch, of which only four in total are known, is the first of the group to be produced, yet the last to appear at auction, appearing for the very first time in this sale. Manufactured in 1943, this wristwatch can be considered the ultimate summit to achieve for the most experienced collectors. Patek Philippe Ref. 1527 $5.7 million. The reference 1527 is the most expensive wristwatch by Patek Philippe ever sold on auction, but it is only upon a closer look when it reveals exactly why it managed to fetch such a stratospheric price. First of all, there is the time when it was made, between 1943 and 1944. It is not merely the fact that the watch was produced during the Second World War, but also that this particular one-of-a-kind piece served as a forerunner to some of the most iconic wristwatches that Patek Philippe has made ever since. For the knowledgeable Patek collector, this piece is a time machine, its elongated and slightly curved lugs, its dial layout and its unusually large diameter for the time of 37.6 mm all preceded other famous Patek references by at least a decade. Furthermore, the overall design and size of this one-of-a-kind piece remains timelessly elegant even 70 years after its creation. This piece was first available for sale more than 20 years ago when it was listed for auction. It had been locked away until it came up for auction at Christie's in 2010. It required great efforts from archivists to further research the past of this piece, as when it was first sold around 1990, there was not much known about it. Ultimately, thanks to the archives of Patek Philippe, it was revealed that it was a perpetual calendar in a reference 1527 case and as such, among the two complicated iterations of this model number ever made by the manufacturer. The other piece lacked the chronograph function and belonged to Charles Stern, the first owner of Patek from the Stern family. The other piece is this unique 1527, which not only proved to be the most complicated piece of this reference, but also a time machine that preceded some of Patek's most famous wristwatches by decades. Hublot Big Bang $5 million. This is easily the most expensive Hublot wristwatch, which retails at a whopping $5 million and was also the timepiece that was gifted to popular rapper and music artist, Jay-Z on his birthday by his wife in 2012. This is a truly fascinating watch by Hublot as it is enveloped in about 1282 diamonds of numerous varieties and styles. Some of these shiny pieces include six emerald cut diamonds that are approximately three carats per diamond. Additionally, there is a mighty 100 carats worth of baguette diamonds aesthetically placed in this watch. What makes this watch so special is the sheer amount of precision that has gone into making this watch. A New York jeweler was responsible for making this timepiece so irresistible thanks to the 40-plus years of experience he brought with him whilst cutting every stone that sits snugly on this watch. It exudes an air of luxury and elegance that is effortless.